Hey folks, Alex here. Let's talk about Before the Green Moon, or I guess I should say, let's play Before the Green Moon. This is... <laughs> um, this is a game, obviously, as many things are. Um, but it's kind of the anti-farming sim. And you might be asking what I mean by that. And you'll see. You'll, you'll see. Oh, this is hair? No, eyes. Why are you changing my... This is my hair color. Just let me get black. Yeah, that's close enough. Um, eyes. Um, oh, that's how that works. I played this before. Um, but it's been... A while. I mean, like, a while. What kind of hair do I have right now? It was that, when I donated my hair. Um, I mean, it's not quite, like, dinky like this, but this might be accurate enough, honestly. That's this. Lighters. Those color obviously blue. That's accurate for that. Chin. Confirm. There we go. This is you. As close to as it will be. You are called... Alex. I went to the youth farmers. The old folks walked me there. It took three days. After Kelly left, and then Kelly's messages stopped, and then you died. The old folks felt we couldn't stay in the marsh. And they couldn't look after me. They walked with me. Then they left for Anarchus before the land bridge flooded. I liked the youth farmers. It reminded me of our garden. It was hard to fit in with the others from bigger comms, but I liked the work. One day a person from the moon came to talk to us. We're looking for farmers now. We'll take one on down here. After some time, one can go up there. They brought 30 musicians who played as one. All of their strange instruments immaculate. I closed my eyes. The song became Kelly's voice. Welcome to Before the Green Moon. There he is. Local branch time, 20 hours and 22 minutes. Trip time, 25 hours in motion. 6 hours charging or waiting for signal. Signal low, battery low, water low. A little grouchy. Good evening. Evening, about to enter low power mode. Is it alright if I park here a while? Actually, if you could pull forward about two lengths. Good night. Good night. This will be yours. Never lived alone before. Was an adjustment for me as well. Personal dom domiciles are an interesting experience. The company would prefer if we operate down here as they do. Up there. I should start getting used to it. Yes, I should start getting used to it. You intended to emigrate, yes. Ooh, I think I'll turn in. That's in the the. Oh, oh, I've got your yawn. The bed is in the back there. I'll come by in the morning. Please, have a good rest. Thank you, Carol. 
Of course, of course. So, this is before the green moon. And things look a little dinky. I'm too tired to leave now. It's part of the style. That you've carried tools. Uh, this game will be sort of familiar to those who've played Stardew and uh, Harvest Moon. Fiberglass tub with a shallow pool of warm health gel. A filling sticker states in case of emergency. So we have equipped a couple of different things. We have the sundial, and we have the heart monitor. Old time band, and this will tell us the current time. We have nothing on the shelf. Well, turn off the lights. A small metal box that fixed the floor. It's scratched and dented on the top, and the sides are in particular around the keyhole. Let's head to bed. Go to bed. Close your eyes and go to sleep. End of the day. Today, zero dollars. Auto deposit not active. Moonrise savings and on hand zero. We're Baroque. Thank you. Yep, there is our inventory. Z makes it disappear. Yeah. A little muddy. Everything seems to be in working order. Good morning. Oh, good morning. Good morning, good morning. I wasn't quite sure if you're going to sleep in. Just doing a couple simple checks. Everything is alright. So, I believe that you spent time in the youth farmers? Yes. Good. Our operations are based on the UF, YF principles, so this should all feel familiar. My position is administrator. Is a Gorian? Does this mean anything to you? Gorian. Parent Gorian. Teacher. I had a teacher at YF. They told us how to do things. And start questions like that. I don't have anything useful to teach you. I will always try my best to answer your questions. I oversee the operations and personnel on this compound. Or branch, as they like to call it. I mostly make reports and assist visitors from the lift. Think of me as a resource, if you will. An experienced friend. Full storage, you can access it inside as well. You should have all the tools you need. Let me see. Till and a watering can. There's a water filling station on the other side of the fields. Seeds are... there aren't any seeds. Oh, right, those are over here. The seed drop box will replenish daily, I believe. They'll send you what they want you to grow. And this... This is the shipping chute. Anything you put in here will be automatically packed and loaded for delivery. Your account will be credited overnight. We use Mooney currency here. Put on your ID, no papers or coins. A quantitative merit system. It really helps us admin types keep track of output. I quite like it. You can spend it on supplies or tools at the Moon Company vending machines. I use it for everything up there. Hmm, anything else? Do you have any questions for me? How do I get to the moon? Ah, uh, well. So you're really hoping to go? Can I? Of course. You stop by the administration tower in town, I can help you get set up. Many who have come to work here have gone up. I'm sure we'll be able to join them. Until then, I hope you enjoy your time here. Keep home this way, into the town. There are a couple other residents. All very personable. If you need anything, please don't hesitate. Very well. Let's get started. Yeah, so the time cycle is very short in this game. We have to move fast, and you'll get to see why. But, as you saw, um, we are going to try to go to the moon. 
And to do so, we need to make as much money as possible. Uh, but here's the kicker, right? This rainy season only lasts for, I believe it's two weeks in game. And once the rainy season's over, it's dry season for a long, long time. Uh, this is the crop basket. You can load crops into it for your limited inventory space and dump them all into the thing over there. I don't remember. Is there a way to jump in this game? Three box for showing shipping food is empty. Small brass tag where someone scratched apples. Uh, you have to put water into here, if I remember correctly. Got a bit of insider knowledge on account of uh, me having played before and meeting the creators of the game, which would be cool, or at least one of them. He got, uh, I got to ask him a couple questions about this game, and it was really cool. Uh, most people don't know this area exists, but this is the most important place to go in the rainy season. This is the forest where you can get ground apples, and ground apples are used as feed for chickens. And chickens, which you can either find up here or somewhere else in the town, which I'll show off a bit later, are a valuable, valuable source of, uh, of income. As you can see right now, my stamina bar is going down like crazy because it's storming insanely much. Insanely much, that's not really a word, but... Afternoon, you get a cut in. Taking shelter down here just for the time being before I go back out. Alright, we're running. And shift is an auto sprint button, so that's why we're getting so tired. I think? Maybe not? I don't know. I don't remember. See if we can get lucky and find ourselves a chicken anywhere. Not yet. We are getting plenty of grown apples, which is fantastic. Without ground apples, uh, you won't be able to feed your chickens, and you won't get any eggs. And I'm back to the farm. Really tired. Yeah, I forgot the the thunderstorm weather drains your uh, your stamina and health like crazy. I'm gonna take shelter really fast. Yeah, in case of emergency. Oh, we're getting there. Look at all these ground apples I have. Let me open. Shelf. We're gonna go ahead and just stow them all on the shelf here. Yep. Easy apple that sprouts from the ground, not native, but easy to find growing around here now. My stamina is completely depleted. And if I go, I can save, I can look at my options. Still storming? That's a yes. Even the rainy season is. So unbelievably brutal. <laughs> so I wait for time to pass just a bit. Um, see. Can't remember if there's anything else in the house I need to take care of. Not particularly. All right, knock me out. Go ahead. And this is important too. There are vending machines every. So often, and they use moon coins, and they give you improved items, and you can buy ground apples here, called synth apples. But we want to avoid doing that, uh, because spending our hard-earned cash on apples is a complete waste. Over here, sometimes there will be items, or sometimes there will be people there. I just picked up a snail, what this is right here. You can sell the snails. And they come out, I believe, only in the rainy season as well. Sometimes you get the E to interact prompt. You can also use the enter key for, which you guys don't really need to know that. That's more for me. We're going to go in here, into the mess hall. Hey, come on in. Grab a seat. Been waiting for you. Name's Elvis. What's yours? Carol told me you showed up recently. You hungry? You know what? It doesn't matter. I'm gonna make you something. If you don't finish it, I will, okay? I'm hungry. Try I run messier like any calm you've lived in. I'm here most of the day. I do my best. 
I'm human. I need breaks. Sometimes I sleep in. Carol wants from 8 to 18, and I generally do it. I'm here. I'll make you food. I could go for a burger right now, man. Here you go. It's hot. Thank you. I'll take Moody or any of that shit. Company would like if I reinforced the ecosystem, but right now we'll take anyone who runs food. They sourced me some ingredients. This kiss had kitten has nice amenities. If you want anything fresh enough extras, I'll always take some. Which is your sign that you can gift NPCs things. Well, it's delicious. Delicious. I know it is. Well, what's your name? Oh, sorry, Alex. Great to meet you. Glad you're here. In all bold font. Be around, alright? I believe I can gift him a snail. Maybe not. I know I can gift him other things. Over here's Marshall. It's good to have a fresh face around here. Fresh footprints on the ground. Glad you came. You can only talk to some of the NPCs, not all of them. Another snail. And the food restored your uh, your stamina bar, which is nice. Hello? There's a transition to evening. And you can pick up all the little scrap things around here. At the end of the day, it'll give you some cash for it. Which is real nice. Uh, we're gonna see if we can find chickens in the spot I was telling you guys about. Get the snail right here? No? That's fine. Yep, you can kick the trash, you can pick it up. Um, picking up trash is a really good way to make money early on, when you have basically nothing. Hold it! Hold it right there! You're the new farmer? Yeah. Granny told me you were coming soon. You are bad luck, but Granny said you might be able to help me. Bad luck? All farmers bad luck, it's not your fault. I'm not bad luck. If it's all of you have ever known, you wouldn't be able to tell. That's Ant. Int? I don't remember. Int, I think. Um, but sometimes you can also find chickens roaming around here. Grab as many of these snails as we can, and then we're gonna run back because I don't see any chickens around before it gets uh, too late. It also becomes nearly impossible to see at night. Give me this. Give me this. It's another snail. Oh God! Go! 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 Let me up the stairs. Uh, but like, it's this game's really interesting because virtually nothing exists about it online. There are a couple of resources, um, but it wasn't until I asked the game dev himself where to find ground apples that I learned you can get them in the forest area, which is up by the coop. Okay, we're selling all the snails and going inside. Now you can see we have 55 coins, and that comes from picking up scrap. Bedtime. Look at all those snails. To the moon they go. Just a little bit of cash. Nothing too crazy. Since it's raining, we're gonna go out. We're gonna grab the seeds. We only got two today. Plant them. And you're right off to work. I'm gonna go grab ground apples. I missed. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. Christ. Go get as many ground apples as possible. And I could cut down some of this. Um, mm -hmm. Some of the grass here. But I won't. They hear chicken. Am I crazy? 
The answer would be yes to both. The world may never know. Give me this. Oh, there was another one hiding. I can also give ground apples to Elvis if I want to. Um, I don't. So I won't. I could. Okay, no ground apples over here. Makes life a lot easier. Well, I would prefer more, but if there's nothing for me to search, that means I can get back to the farm faster. Now I'm gonna go into town. I'm not gonna stop here. You can see that our crops have been watered by the rain this morning, which is wonderful. I'm gonna go talk to some of the other NPCs, but first we're gonna go over here. Talk to this fella. How can I help you? Hey, I haven't seen you before, you must be new. I collect stuff from the shoot and sell it to comms all over. Farm RC farm stuff sometimes, I'll keep you in mind. Yeah, looks I've got some good stuff. We gotta talk over here. You can buy seeds. And this is a dry a dry season plant, which will grow all dry season. Fishing rod, side table is just decoration. And these are also dry season plants. But since we're in wet season, we don't care. Expert fishing rod would be nice. Um, but for now, I can't use it. Good afternoon. We're gonna go up to another NPC. Oh sure, come on in. I'll be right with you. What is it, Carol? More papers to sign or- Oh! Yeah, Carol. Maybe you smashed my beakers, whoever you are. I just moved here. Wow, you came here from somewhere else? You wanted to come here? End of the world this place is. Well, let me get a good look at you. I'll tell you this was your new house? We don't do group houses here. Weird, I know. I like him to err clerically. I'm here another night, unfortunately. You'll have to sleep in the dirt. I have. Maybe that's a little cruel. You can sleep on the floor tonight. Bed's yours tomorrow. I'm hiding in the morning. So long. There's a glass on the floor now. Your fault though. Uh, uh, what's your name? Alex. I'm living at the farm. Oh, ho, that makes more sense. I was thinking like Carol. Come on, buddy. Wow, the old farm, huh? Didn't think I'd ever see anyone else living there. Growing plants. Sounds nice. Oh well. Back to packing for me. Gonna meet you, Alex. So long. I can clean an hour and die. Sorry. You can sit at the laptop too, which is cool. But alas, we will not be. I didn't know you could go to bed here. The more you know. Maybe I will have to do that at some point. All in the name of research. I think it's cool that I get to learn new things about this game as I play it. Trash. You can hear the sound of scrap turning into money. Alright, let's go out to the end again. These hands over here. Now right here. Pickens. Yeah, I want to cut down just some of this. Doesn't sound like there are any chickens around. You, however, have the ability to talk to it. Hmm, is this really the best spot? We'll get it started. Hi, hello, farmer. Even if I am bad luck, I can't hurt to talk. I suppose not, just a little. And it starts doing their thing. But we're not going to be able to get to that for a little while, so we're just going to go back to the back to the town and go talk to more of the villagers before it turns to night time. We're going to try to stop by and see Carol as well. Something I want to swing by on the way to Carol. Forgot I, I either can't get up there or there's just stairs that are obscured. Either way, I'm stupid. 
snail over here. He thought he could hide, he was wrong. Right here. Cool. Over here is where you can buy uh, useful things, like an umbrella. Which protects you from the rain. The rain poncho, which is it's just better to save for the poncho. The drone lights. Um, technically illegal, you don't lose anything for having one. Uh, but what it is, is the drone light will let you... Uh, it'll give you light at night, which is nice. We're going to save for the drone light. And then this cutscene shows you things like where things are on the map, which is cool. Now I can go, and the snail will actually be there. There's Carol, though. We're going to stop by Elvis and head home. Hello, Alex. Open the Moon Company Administration Tower. Can I assist you in any... Can I assist you in an administrative capacity today? How are you doing today? Hey, Carol. How are you doing? I'm feeling most at ease today, in my element. Can I assist you with anything else? How do I go to the moon? Of course, of course, you'd mentioned before. I can help you get set up. Thank you, of course. Come with me. Let us use the Moon Terminal Company Terminal together. These are state-of-the-art. Terminal technology from up there. We can use this to initialize your account. Just give me one moment. Let me see here. These terms have been updated as of... Any questions see your branch administrator? That's me. Here we go. Moon Rise Program. Section 1. Eligibility. Moon Company registrants in the qualified work classes may immigrate at a reduced cost via the Moon Rise Program. See your branch administrator for complete list. Let me just double check. Class A. Agriculture Farmer. Excellent. Section 2. Installments. Automatic installments will be withdrawn and stored in the Moonrise Program Savings Account. Stored of value cannot be withdrawn and only transferred with approval. This will withdraw percent can be set at 10, 15, or 30. So, every amount of profit we make, 10% will be sent to our savings account to go to the moon. It's always bittersweet saying goodbye, but also very exciting also. A bright future. Thank you, Carol. Anytime. Always. Yep, so... Um, if Carol will move out of the way. Hello, you ready to go to the moon yet? Yeah, tickets are a little pricey. Um, but the auto deposit is on 10%, which we can lower even more. We're going to do 5%. Wish you the best of luck in all your future endeavors, because we want a lot of money. Uh, of which we have none currently. We go this way. Um, I'm going to go this way, though. I'm gonna get down to uh, night time soon. I better fast. Let's stop by Elvis really fast, too. We'll see if he's in. Yep, there he is. Hey, how's it going, Elvis, if you forgot? I like cooking for folks. Don't be shy, okay? Come eat. Yo, good? Gotta run. And we're gonna run down. Here. This is what we got shown in our cutscene. There are things over here. Whoa. Leave. I got that one I did. This is why we need the drone light. I can't see right now. Like, at all. I guess I can see if I look at my other monitor, but that feels like cheating. What if I got hit by this truck? That'd be funny. Oh, look at the scrap. Give me that shit. Gotta make ends meet somehow. Um, I'm not gonna buy any seats from you. Even though I should buy a cashew. Cashews are a very good way to make money in the dry season, but I'm not gonna worry about it for now. Now, I'm just gonna deposit... All of my snails. That you can undo cells. I forgot. And we're going to go inside. Put our five ground apples. Okay. Or not. I guess ten is the max, or nine is the max. I don't remember. Got bamboozled. Look at that. Yep, auto calculates out. Five percent and stores it away. All right, we saved 30 coins towards, uh, <laughs> towards, 
110,000. All right, let's go outside. Raining. Raining. Let's go grab these. I don't remember. Does this stock change every day? Um, yeah, it does. Or at least it changed the order. The axe will let me break wood and stuff. Hammer lets me break rocks. I don't really care for any of this right now, though. I'm just going to stockpile my equipment. I'm going to stockpile my money. Alright, that's still over here. We got three, looks like. And then tomorrow, these crops will be done growing. Hello? Oh, I pushed Q. Q is like last tool. I was being silly. I'm gonna go look for ground apples. And then we're gonna go check for chickens. And then today we're gonna venture down to the docks if I get a chance to. We will see. Three apples already. Wonderful. Technically, if I need to, I can always like go and stockpile this in the chicken feed itself. Uh, but I don't want to. I'm not going to. There we go. Going on down this way. Oh, there's int. Sniff, sniff, sniff. Hi, hi. I didn't know you could find int here. Maybe it's a rainy season only thing. Who knows? Okay. Grab out the ground apples. That was... Oh, there's an axe back here. Hello. Sick. <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. I didn't know that was there. Yeah, you can't cut down any of these trees, unfortunately. It's only like small pieces of wood you that find on your farm. Afternoon. I'm gonna head straight down to the box. Ah, crap. You're really smart. Ah, crap, crap, crap. Hey, are you okay? Hmm, oh yeah, just pressure spiked and the wrench slipped and I... Well, I was only out a little. Ow, might be broken. Did I get someone? I really only know Carol, but... I'm fine, I'm fine, but do you think... Does that have the help for me? It's still a little loose. Okay. I'll try. Great, thank you so much. Like this? That's right. Okay, then. I'm gonna head into town. If you didn't know, Carol was a medic. Always good to know who used to be a medic. She's gonna die. And she's gone. The parts. Sometimes there's stuff down here, like snails. Oh, holy crap, there's a bunch of snails down here. Let me quit. Look at me, I'm making so much money off of this. Snail over here, a snail over here, and a snail over here. You can go fishing up here. Peaceful. I don't remember how bad the fishing minigame was, or how good it was, or how bad I am at it. Is anyone home? No? Cool. Then we're gonna go back to our farm. I'm actually going to take this route back up, because there are some bottles that sometimes spawn over here. So it takes us right into... over here. Which puts me out right next to the entrance to town. It's fantastic, if you ask me. Nails. Uh, I don't think I can grab that one down there still. He's gonna move. Grab this guy though. Give. Mm 
We go to say hi to Pony. I don't remember if I can give her a snail or not. We're going to find out. Snails are pretty cute. One of the first things I like, really like about this place. Snails everywhere. So that's a yes. That's why I was leaving. That's why this time I was leaving for real. But here I am back at work. Hold on. Yeah, she doesn't leave. It's going to hit evening shortly, so I should go see Elvis. He's outside, actually. He's smoking. Better take breaks sometimes. Well said. Here, here. You belong to me now. Alright, evening time. There we go. Now we got an int event. This should be it. This is... We're sure at 19.3. What are you doing? Putting the pieces. Pieces of what? I'm not sure. Do you mind leaving me alone? It is difficult to talk and sort. Oh, sure. I bet you have stuff to do. You're right, I do. Anyways, I need the buttons. Nail. Chicken. Oh, there's a snail up there. Nail right here, too. I'm unbelievably wealthy in snails. Can I give you a snail? Do you take a snail? No, don't set it down. I need the buttons. Okay. I don't think Int wants a snail. Let me across, you asshole. Need cans. Can can cans. Nail up there. There we go. Yep, that's right. I can't go this way. I'd stop at Carol's, honestly. Oh, there's Pony. Pony! I talk to her? Oh, uh, hey, new farmer, right? I probably won't be along, around much longer. Uh, sure. If that's what you think. This building over here is actually Carol's house. Oh, Alex, I hope you're suddenly unwell. I find grabbing a bite of the mess if you need a boost. Very nice thing you have there. Till next time. Can you not give NPCs items and I'm just crazy and I've just been showing it to them this entire time? Like, ooh, look at my snail. Isn't it cool? Goodbye. Is that what I've been doing? As if so, that's really fucking funny. Uh, but that one merchant who shows up over here only shows up, I think it's once every week. I don't remember off the top. 18 snails, we're making bank. Go ahead and put this away. Okay, so it is nine is the max. Bedtime. Boink. Seventy-five. Look at us making such progress. Good morning, Alex. I'm stopping by with an invite to a cookout in the town center this evening. Cookout's theme is an unofficial welcome. A welcome to you, that is. So, hope to see you there. Fun fact, it's completely optional. Three seeds. I'm going to pick all this and put it in the crop basket. I think the crop basket max is like 10. I'm going to replant, and now I want to go dump this basket into the shipping container. And I mean dump. Yep. 
Play that easy. Now I want to go off in search of chickens and grown apples. Fingers crossed they actually spawn. There's pony. Oh, I could have ground apple. Okay, maybe I should just be cutting this stuff down. I mean, I don't exactly have the time to spend cutting it all down with my shitty scythe, and I'm not going to go out and buy a new scythe just to do it. Whatever. Ooh, ooh, it's tough terrain, but I'm keeping up. It comes a dump, uh, except for the forest, and your farm is nice. Lucky you. I think that's what she said. Oh, this is a ground... Oh my god! I am wealthy. One over there. There are two over here. What the fuck? I'm not complaining. This is an incredible stroke of luck for me. Right here. Any up here? No, I'm not going to bother checking the rest. About all the way down here. There's one here. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's afternoon. Means I'll head to town soon. Oh, there is another. Ah. That's insane. How many ground apples did I just get? Let's find out. <laughs> Fifteen. Unbelievably wealthy and ground apples. Let's go run down here really fast, see if we can get any more snails. There are a couple. Let's see if Marie's out by the dock. There's not. She's either inside or she's in town. Let's check inside really fast. Nope. Gaming, let's go to town. Gaming respectfully. Come on. There we go. Would you believe me if I told you this was the the easiest part of the game? Because you're God. Dry season is no joke. Okay, let's go see Elvis. Let's grab the snail off the wall. Just kidding, it's too high. And we'll run and try to get our chicken really fast. I'm cooking most days, mornings and afternoons. Gotta clean up and prep at night. I take one day off, alright? Carol put it on the calendar. Yo, yeah, good? I don't remember where to check the calendar is an issue. <laughs> That's an issue. Hi, Carol. Hey, you've come to the right place for the cookout. You are a little early. I'm still getting prepared. Cool, I'm gonna go look for chickens. Don't worry about me, Carol. Oh, Chuck. There we go. Marshall. Hey, Carol said you're trying to go up there. Good luck to you. Thanks. Ignore the delay on my thank you. I'm just a little bit stupid. Alright, it's evening. Uh, no chickens, but lots of snails. Insane amounts, if you ask me. Let's go up here and talk to Int really fast if Int's inside. Int is. I think I got your name before. I don't give it out too freely. It's something my granny told me. My name is Alex. I'm called Int from Intel. Granny gave it to me. It used to be her name, now it's mine. Goodbye. What? Oh. Is it done? 
No, I wouldn't even call it close to done. Okay, I bet you know what you're building now. No, I wouldn't say I'm close to no one either. But you are making progress. A little. Every day. That's something. Yes. This game's so... I love it. Can I go in this pipe over here? I don't remember. Find out really fast. Well... I think I can. Maybe. I'm gonna try one more time, then I'm gonna go to the barbecue. Uh, maybe not. I don't know why I've never asked myself that before. Maybe I answered it and forgot. There's Elvis. And it's cookout time. Hey, Alex, you made it. Also, Marie couldn't make it. Their neighbors down the light and said to tell you welcome. What about Random Bunny invited her? She was leaving in a decade ago, but she seemed like she was still working. Well, you might see her around yet. We have a moon viewing gathering about once per cycle. It's usually a little more popular. Calendar by the admin building with more details. Oh, wait, that's where it is. I'm gonna go look at it for right now. Just kidding. Well, thanks for coming. I might stick around in case any stragglers show up. Anyways, welcome to our branch. Right around here, when this comes down to me, you wouldn't grab bite early. You're around, alright? Okay, cool. Now we're done. Leave. No, oh, you kicked me all the way back to the. Okay. I wanted to go look at the calendar. Uh oh. Oh, it just sends me back to my. Cool. I don't think I've ever been out past dark before. Go to bed. Look at all that. We're up to uh, 3,000. We're close to the drone. Alright. Four buckweed seeds. Love it. Weed, wheat? Same thing. No, don't. Oh, this Carol. Hello. We'll be right with you, dude. Might be the first day I have to water crops. Off to a good start, don't get to clear up any dead crops. Oh my god. Yeah, clearing these little branches off is what I think the uh, the axe is for. Oh, it's starting to rain. I'm not going to waste my time. Anything else for me? Until next time. No. Oh, cool. Yeah, because the... Oh, it's moon rice, not buckwheat. I don't know where that came from. The moon rice takes up like an entire inventory slot, which is why you use the crop basket. Which is... Insane how well designed that is because it's literally meant to make it feel arduously tedious. Um, I'm inside a bench. Go. Okay, visit the pony. And then I will. What's your deal, anyways? No deal. Didn't think so. Go on. Nail. How many do I have? I have three. Nails are pretty cute. Nails everywhere. Oh. Or. Oh, it's because I had it out. That's why. I was like, did my snail duplicate? I wouldn't have complained if I found a duplication glitch. That would also make the game easier. We go up by Carol's house. That's the calendar. I always fucking forget. Okay, so. Blue is the wet season. Everything else is the dry season. And by everything else, I mean all the red, orange, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. It's brutal. 
It's so brutal. Oh god. So cool. Anything... I'm gonna wait till I can buy the drone light. It should be within the next day or two. I remember that equipping it was weird. Well... Anyways. This and this. Can I get this fish? No, I think I need a fishing rod for it. How oh, sad. The bright side. Bajillion snails. Alright, Int. See the end so clearly, but I'm stuck at this step. How does that happen? A man Elvis, he's an infantry bouffant? Yeah, glad we agree. What is bouffant? Also, I literally never saw Int build this in my last playthrough. What the hell? That's really interesting. Did not know that could happen. Did they patch this game at all recently? Maybe a sequence broke something? Hey, and hold up. Hello. Oh, uh, you never come by the mess. You know you can, right? No one can eat the mess. Mm, no. Okay, well, I brought you some food anyway. Will you take it? Oh. It's very good. Oh, that's a little progress. Hey, Elvis, can I get some of that? Okay. Damn. Ice cold. I love the design of this little town. Before you get to play around a bit, it feels really, really weird navigating it. Um, but then something kind of clicks and it just makes sense. Alright, let's go get some apples. Please give me a chicken. I would love a chicken. Egg. Bees. Alright. Found apple. You know what? Fuck it. You're irritating me. Oh, see? Never would have found that ground apple if I hadn't done that. You idiot. Anyways. Oh, there's another one. Catch your breath. I despise that he puts his tools away every time he starts panting for breath, though. Oh, who was that in the grass? Did I just miss an opportunity to talk to someone? I did. That's the one thing about this game, right? Um... The cycles, like when it does a little cut in, um, the reason that's there. Actually, I don't know if I'm allowed to talk about why that's there. Uh, what it does in the game, though, is it moves around NPC locations. So that way, they don't have to have a, uh, a set path. At least that's my understanding. Which makes it a lot less resource intensive than like a game like Stardew is. Or anything around here worthwhile? Doesn't look like it. Back there. I tell. It must not be important. Question mark. All right. How much time do I have? I have enough time to go down here, I think. Oop! No fall damage, baby! Whoa! Sometimes I take up little chunks of satellites and stuff. Usually I just chuck them in the lake. I skip nicely. Don't tell Maria, alright? Oh, hey, farmer. Hmm.
have a name. Oh, there's a snow. Ooh. Alright, now we run. Let me up, let me up, let me up. Oh, please. Oh, I'm not going to make it to the box in time. Please, please, please. No! <laughs> oh. Cool. Another stack. I... What? Okay. Anyways. Yeah. Chopping up six in the field till 20 uses left. Oh, my lord. And I'll divide that out. Getting close to the drone light. I think with that, I'm going to leave this episode of Before the Green Moon here. Yes, that's right, I said episode. I'm going to probably record multiple episodes of Before the Green Moon. Because I adore this game. Um, I hope you folks will see why by the end. We'll see. Um, but I will see you all next time. Hasta luego.